squeezing the northeast. <coughs> Friendly, friendly, friendly. Want it, want it, friendly. What the hell? Yeah, apparently the 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 word is they uh, like this is a newer version of Infusion, whereas Daisy Standalone still has like old areas of the game that are actually still from like Arma. It's not completely Infusion in in, in some rights. So like this is uh, just like a, you know, a newer version. I mean like all of these interiors and doors and stuff like that. All this shit looks like straight out of just like Chinaris, you know, like some, a lot of the barns and the warehouses and stuff like that. It's very like, uh, you know, it's just like, hey, it's it's, it's not the Arma 2 asset that's been around for like fucking. Oh, they're already in there. It's not the Arma 2 asset that's been around for like ten fucking years. It's like brand new. Every door you can open, dude. Like, um, he's down. You can like flush toilets and shit. Like, they have like loot containers that you can loot. Like. Imagine like walking into a room in Daisy and not just like looking at the floor like and that's the extent of the looting in the game And then you fucking leave, you know, it's it's awesome, man And like I can already tell like a lot of this stuff looks like Stuff that could be used for like life servers and whatnot like I, I almost have a feeling like their current game mode is called conflict I guarantee you there'll be like logistics for like food and fuel and like water and shit even um, And all of that could be translated over into like a survival uh, type experience but even the gunplay, like the movement and everything, just feels like it feels like Daisy standalone, but just better. Like here, let me show you a couple of cool things that I, I honestly, these are things that are standard. Like that vaulting is just straight out of Daisy, right? You don't have to worry about like, oh man, I can't like get just my muzzle a little bit higher so I can shoot over. You can just like manually adjust your dude's stance as you want. Um, and like there's like uh, ready positions, low ready positions, readies, aims. You can zoom in, you know, it's just. It's like Arma simplified with uh, oh, yeah. a lot of the controls because like Arma oh, 3, yeah, and I'm sure you played it, like oh, the one. controls are like ridiculous, dude. There's like a million hotkeys and like it's either you have mu muscle memory for Arma or no other game. You know, it doesn't really cross over to anything where, I mean, I'd rather play this than Squad, personally. Because I feel like there's so much more that you can do with this compared to Squad. And it's on a different engine, like, I don't really like UE4. Like, UE4 is like not a bad engine, but it's just not... Not my favorite, dude. <laughs> dude, what the fuck? <laughs> I think I was hitting his gun because I know in this your 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 rifles is actually an ar armor. Like uh, it can stop a bullet, so you can you can literally like. Just eat shots as much as you want to your rifle and it doesn't affect it. I think I shot his gun quite a few times, bro. We got a big hitbox, man. <laughs> it makes me wonder if like an armor system is like possible in this game, like with helmets and body armor and shit. Dude, that would be fucking really cool. I think I'm hitting his gun, dude. I, I really think I feel like I'm shooting people's fucking weapons. Because I know they're a hitbox in this. They can stop rounds. Ah, ah fuck. Ran out of rounds. Need to use this.
what the fucking hit red, dude. Ah. Uh, I think that might have been friendly that just gunned me down. That was a nice little streak, though. Dude, look, there's destruction. What the fuck? No way. <gasps> Wait, dude, there, there's environmental destruction. Those concrete walls are blown up. Bro, that is so sick. I, dude, I didn't know you could blow those up. See how laggy that is? That was a nice little push in there, though. Oh, fuck! <laughs> ah! No! <laughs> I got the radio, dude. <laughs> yeah, Arma definitely did. Uh, kind of defined a generation of games, I totally agree. I mean, Arma made DayZ. If Arma never existed, DayZ would never exist, and DayZ is... Probably, I, I would say, one of the most influential PC games ever made. For a multitude of reasons. The biggest reason is uh, why we've had so many shitty early access games for the past seven, eight years was because when Daisy Standalone launched in 2013 as a completely unfinished alpha, they sold six million copies in 30 days and the entire gaming industry realized like, oh fuck, we can make a lot of money off these guys who are willing to buy unfinished shit. And the entire gaming industry realized that and um you know they obviously took advantage of, of consumers because of it um but it's also led to a lot of really great uh games uh that have been inspired by daisy because of its gameplay loop and it's fun you know just the, the nature that daisy has as a video game Oh, my game crashed. <laughs> what the fuck? Dude, it, yeah, but it, it, it's fun, man. I, I like it. I'm honestly really excited for mods. I'm really, uh, like, this is actually the first mod I've ever played. It's just a new uh, game mode. It's basically King of the Hill uh, in, in a very small scale. And, dude, it, it's, it's a lot of fun, man. I really, really enjoy it.